Talking about cancer can be scary, but educating ourselves about the warning signs and symptoms is important so we can catch it early and get the proper treatment. According to the National Cancer Institute, colon cancer or colorectal cancer is the third most common type of cancer in the United States. In simple terms, colon cancer begins in the large intestine, also known as the colon, which is an essential part of our digestive system and where the final stages of digestion take place. Colon cancer is more common in older adults. However, it can happen to anyone, and in recent years, it has been on the rise in young adults. The good news is that colon cancer can be prevented and successfully treated, especially if it is caught early. So in this video, we are going to discuss the warning signs and symptoms of colon cancer that should not be ignored as well as what you should do if you notice any of these signs. Hi, Jidosa the Farm B here. Welcome and please like and subscribe the channel. Colony cancer usually starts with small tissue growth called polyps in the colony. Most of these polyps are not cancerous, but some may grow out of control and turn into cancer. Many people with colon cancer may not have any symptoms in early stages. As cancer grows, you may start to notice the symptoms that we are about to discuss shortly. Number one, changes in bowel habits. From time to time, changes in bowel movements are common and can be caused by many factors, such as the food you ate or bacterial infections. But if you have diarrhea or constipation for a long time, it could be a sign of something worse like colon cancer. Colon cancer can cause changes in bowel habits, such as diarrhea or constipation, because the tumor growth can block the colon and prevent a normal passage of stools through the digestive system. These changes in bowel habits can be a warning sign of colon cancer. So if you experience these symptoms for several weeks, you should definitely see a doctor. Number two, rectal bleeding or blood in your stool. Many things can cause rectal bleeding or blood in your stool, like hemorrhoids or anal fissures, which are usually not serious. However, it can also be a sign of a more severe condition such as a colorectal cancer. In colon cancer, the tumor can cause bleeding in the colony or rectum, leading to blood in the stool or rectal bleeding. Blood in the stool can vary in color from bright red to dark red or black, and the amount can also vary from few drops to significant amount. You may also notice blood appearing in your stool or toilet paper after wiping. So it's important to speak with a medical professional to determine the cause and receive appropriate treatment. Number three, weight loss and you don't know why. Unexplained weight loss is a classic symptom of many type of cancer, including colon cancer. So why do colon cancer cause weight loss? Well, it's because cancer can change the way your digestive system works. In this case, weight loss can be due to diarrhea, vomiting, anemia, and loss of appetite, as well as the high energy demands of growing cancer cells. So if you are losing weight without trying or have noticed a sudden drop in your appetite, it's worth investigating. Number four, abdominal pain or cramping. People often have abdominal pain which usually does not mean anything serious. However, if you experience severe long-lasting abdominal pain, usually in your lower abdomen, that does not seem to have a clear reason. It could be a sign of colon cancer. Even though other inflammatory bowel diseases like Crohn's disease or celiac disease can also cause abdominal pain, it's important to pay attention to how severe and how long the pain lasts. 
And if it comes with other alarming symptoms like changes in stool or rectal bleeding, you should seek medical guidance for an early diagnosis and possible treatment. Number five, feeling like you need to have bowel movement that does not go away even after doing so. Colon cancer can cause a feeling like you need to have a bowel movement that does not go away after doing so because cancer growth can partially or completely block the colony or rectum. This blockage can lead to a buildup of stool behind the blockage, causing the feeling of needing to go to the bathroom. However, since the stool cannot pass through the blockage area, the feeling is not relieved even after trying to have the bowel movement. These symptoms is important to watch out for and discuss with a healthcare provider, especially if you experience this regularly, as it may indicate a serious medical condition such as colon cancer. Number six, weakness and fatigue. Chronic fatigue is a common sign of colon cancer. It can be caused by several things, such as bleeding that leads to anemia, not getting enough nutrients, diarrhea, or problem absorbing nutrients. Also, cancer cells require a lot of energy and nutrients to grow and multiply, which can make you feel weak and tired. Now, let me be very clear. If you have the above symptoms, it does not mean you have colon cancer. They could be the signs and symptoms of other health conditions. So, it's worth discussing with your doctor to rule out any underlying causes, as well as getting recommendations for screening and prevention. Don't just assume the symptoms will go away. Cancer is one of the worst diseases to find out you have. But it's even worse to avoid early detection, which could save your life. Knowing the early warning signs, being proactive with the regular screenings starting at age 45, living a healthy lifestyle, and being aware of risk factors like being older, being an African American, having a family history of colon cancer or polyps, having a personal history of inflammatory bowel disease, smoking, and being overweight can greatly reduce your risk of colon cancer. And there you have it. Also, make sure to watch the video in the top right corner. In this video, we discuss the warning signs and symptoms of prostate cancer. I will also leave a link in the description below. Thanks for watching. I hope you find this video helpful. And don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to the channel for more health and wellness videos. Have a wonderful day. Bye.